everyone. Today is Saturday and um, it's just me in Boston here right now. The girls went to Walmart to pick up a few things. And so yeah, it's just me. I actually was out earlier. Guess what you guys, I'm so excited. So I found out that Ikea has like a curbside pickup where you order online and then you're able to um, call when you get there and they bring your thing out. The process is a, little, is a little bit different. So when you order online, you actually have 24 hours to pick it up. Um, and then if you don't, they put it back on the shelf or something like that. But anyway, I'm so happy because now I can get my seat cover because I'm telling you guys, that seat cover is seriously bugging me. I'm just OCD like that. And yeah, so I'm gonna do that tonight and probably pick it up tomorrow, hopefully. And then um, I was at Walmart earlier because, okay, I finally got a bin for my fall decorations. Remember when I showed you guys when I cleaned the area and I put it in those bags and put it in my kitchen nook? It's been there ever since. And yeah, there's CP time and there's Michelle time. And so sometimes I do things on my own time. So it's been sitting there ever since. So I finally got a bin today because tomorrow I'm actually gonna take down the tree. So I might as well put everything in the garage while I'm doing it. And yeah, and right now I am just uploading a video that should have got to you guys like the day after Christmas, but y'all know me, y'all know me. And so that's that and i got something for boston he i hope he loves it because i don't know if i told you guys but when we first got him i didn't mind him sitting in my couch i put a blanket on there for him to just sit on that spot and stay but now that he's comfortable this is his home he roams the couch he scratches his ear he just tries to make it comfortable you know like be a dog and so can't get mad at him for that, but I don't want him scratching up my couch, so I don't let him sit on my couch anymore. Then we got him his like bed for him to lay on the floor, but he still, he'll lay on the floor, but he still doesn't like the bed. He'd rather the couch, but so I got him, and I'll show you guys in a little bit, I got him his own personal bed where he can feel lifted, like he can feel like he's on his couch. I hope he likes it because um, it wasn't cheap. So yeah, I'll show you guys that a little bit later. But now let me just, um, the video's uploading, but I need to make a thumbnail. So let me do that and then I'll be back. This was one of Savannah's gifts for Christmas. It's a karaoke machine and she needs to put it away, but this is where she holds her nightly concerts. Thanks for that, Savannah. Okay, you guys, so this is Boston's new bed chair type thing. I hope he likes it. I just put it on top of his bed that he really doesn't like laying on. So hopefully he will like this. He's outside right now. So when I bring him in, hopefully he will like it. So I got some new kitchen towels and some dish rags and pot holders. And yeah, I'm just gonna, I took all the tags off. So I'm just going to put them in the wash and then put them away i think they're really cute and i got red because you guys know my kitchen cabinets are like red or what i like to call it cherry wood red but really not cherry wood but yeah that's the reason why i got the red just to tie in that color even more this one is my favorite i don't know why but yeah so i'm just gonna wash those and i'm so excited you guys i'm gonna order some new pots because my old pots i have when i moved into this house i bought Paula Dean set of pots and just because I liked the color it was when I was in love with like greens and browns this was before the whole Paula Dean candle that she had whatever but anyway I am ordering some pots from Rachel Ray because they're non-stick and I just like the pots I've wanted these pots for a long time and I don't know why I didn't buy them but our pots right now I'm not even going to show you the bottom of some of the skillets we some of the skillets I won't even use because you know how you clean them up really good and try to you know get them clean and you scrape it with the pot scraper well it's scratched that's just not good for you so it's time and I actually went to Target tonight and I did see the exact set that I wanted and it wasn't that expensive it was like a set of 13 pots but I want to get the ones with the red handle because my cabinets are red, you know, just to tie it in. I seen gray, but I don't know. I think if I was to get the gray one, I would regret my decision. And I don't know, just seeing the red pots because they did have single ones that were hanging up from Rachel Ray. And I'm like, no, I better wait. So 
I'm just going to order it and I'll probably do that tomorrow or maybe tonight. I don't know. So yeah, you guys, it's been a productive day. I'm waiting on Savannah to get out of the shower. We are going to watch Snowpiercer. Um, it has David Diggs on it. Y'all know, I'll, if y'all don't know, I'm so in love with him since Hamilton. He played Thomas Jefferson and Marquis de Lafayette. So anyway, we're watching that um, when Savannah gets out of the shower. Um, Cause I guess the whole, all of season one is on there. I'm just gonna heat me up some leftovers. I have um, some food that I got at Loving Hut. It's a vegan place. No, I'm not vegan, Edna. No, I'm not. She's not getting me, but certain things that I've tasted, I like it. So, yeah, that's about it. Not doing much at Good all. Good morning, everyone. It is Sunday, and I realized I didn't show you guys Boston in his new little bed thing. And that's because I think he still has to get used to it. So at first he didn't want to go in it. And then when he went in it, he would just sit there and he'd get out. But then there were a couple of times that he did get in on his own. So I think he just has to get used to it. So I'm going to give him maybe a week or two. And if for some reason I see that he is just not going in it at all, then I'll return it. But... Then again, I'm thinking, I'm like, well, what if we get another dog? It'll probably be around the size of Boston. What if that dog likes it? So I don't know. I'll see. I'm trying to give him a chance to get used to it and then go from there. Anyway, so today, did I say a Sunday? I made a project for my room. My whole room, not my whole room, but um, the little corner that I'm doing. Uh, it's like little projects that I'm doing. And I completed one and I actually filmed it. And I'm going to add it to the reveal video. But... While I was filming it, the doorbell rang and I got a package that I've been waiting for so excited. Not my last thing for my room, but something that is going to go in there. And the weird thing is what I have, okay, what I got, it wasn't expensive, right? But it came in black, white, which are basic colors, and then different oak different wood colors like mahogany and oak, and one was called paprika. So the weird thing is the same thing that I got the exact same thing for black or white it was more expensive I don't get it so I'm like well that's crazy I know how to paint y'all know me I'm pretty handy when it comes to a paintbrush so I just got the least expensive one which is the exact same thing I really wanted white and I'm going to put it together and paint it so I'm gonna do that now but I'm not gonna show you guys but I'm excited because it's finally starting to come together I can see the whole picture in my head so y'all I can't wait to reveal it to you not today but yeah y'all know what I'm saying so it's about 2 15 and I don't know why I say about it is 2 15 and I still have my tree up I totally got distracted and even though I can still take it down I don't know I just want to enjoy it one more day sitting here watching some YouTube videos and that's about it you guys he's laying in it and of course he's gonna get out now because I'm up he was laying down in it you guys and he got in it on his own say hi tell everybody how you like your new little bed Say hi, everybody. Oh my god. You look so cute. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But I think it's really cool. It's not close at all. It's much later and haven't been doing a whole lot at all. I've just been painting all day. I don't know if you can see the paint on my hands. Um, I got to get up and add another coat to what I'm doing. So that's the reason why I didn't really wash it off yet because I'm going to go back to it and probably get my hands even messier. Anyway, um, I'm actually learning how to distress something because I painted it but if I keep this white and the other thing that I painted white everything is just going to be solid white and I don't know just to me it didn't look that great so I'm actually distressing it and it's the first time I've done anything like that before it didn't seem too hard so it actually came out okay and the good thing about it is if you mess up you can just go back over with the other color paint so yeah, I just want that worn weathered look to one of the items that I am painting. And yeah, that's it. Um, Shine and Savannah actually went to Carl's Jr. Um, I don't want anything from them, but Savannah likes the, it's the vegan burger there, the Beyond Meat. Yeah, the Beyond Meat um, Famous Star. So when we go there, she likes to get that. So that's what she's getting. And 
I'm actually not really hungry right now. But the funny thing is, watch when they bring their food. I'm going to wish that I gave them money to get me something. That usually how it always happens. We were actually watching Snowpiercer. Um, we're on the fourth episode and it's so good. Oh, you guys. So if you have HBO Max and you want something good to watch, I think it's about eight or ten episodes, but it's called The Undoing. Nicole Kidman is in there and Hugh Grant and it it's really good it, it's really good um if you've seen it let me know if you haven't seen it and you have hbo max go check it out i don't want to give any spoilers away but yeah it's really good speaking of nicole kidman i've always thought she was pretty and you know i don't knock anyone if they want to get something done to make themselves feel better like a touch up here or there or whatever but to me she went a little bit overboard because don't get me wrong she's still pretty but I just think it's too much she doesn't really look the same like she used to I guess that's the point she's still trying to look younger but I just think she did a little bit too much because she was always pretty to me so anyway yeah okay it's Monday and it's after work I'm loving this working from home in my pajamas y'all anyway so I'm about to take the Christmas decorations down and clean up in here a little bit so okay everything back to normal it always looks so bare after christmas yeah and i'm about to vacuum good morning everyone it is saturday and no i'm not going anywhere but i do have my hair on um it is saturday it's a little bit after 8 a.m and yes i am up and that's because i feel like the camera's like super close that's because i went to bed last night like around seven or maybe before seven because I was just extremely tired and when five o'clock came I was wide awake and I was just like tossing and turning in bed looking at you know Instagram and whatnot so um like 6 30 I just got up I'm like might as well just get up I hate getting up this early on a Saturday when I could sleep in but I went to bed super early so I got up and I started straightening up the house I washed the dishes. I don't know if you can hear the dishwasher in the background. I started laundry. I watered my plant already, even though I have a timer set for noon. So that's done. And right now I'm actually just about to paint this base. Yes, you heard me I said I'm going to paint it. This is actually going to be for my mom. I will show you guys when I'm done, but yeah, it's just a regular base I got from Dollar Tree and I'm going to paint it. Yeah, I'll show you guys when I'm done. I think it's going to turn out cute because I did something similar like last week and she just wants me to make her one. So I'm going to do that. Everyone's asleep right now. Um, I'm the only one up. So yeah, I'm actually kind of bored because no one's up, but it's quiet other than the dishwasher. And I know you guys can see the bag of chips that's up there. Um, just need to put it away. That's actually Cheyenne's. Um, she takes chips like that to work. Um, and then the other bags are just project stuff in it, like crafts and stuff like that. So I don't know why I'm telling you guys, you guys are nasty. Anyway, let me get to painting this bottle and I will show you guys the progress. Oh, and also I wanted to tell you guys, so I'm super excited. I know I haven't vlogged in a while, so this is going to go onto what I had, um, before, but I'm getting new pots and I don't know if I told you guys this yes I did tell you guys this because I said I wasn't gonna show you guys my pots because they're so old but my pots are old it's scratched at the bottom and a lot of that probably has to do with the Brillo pad that I use to clean them because I do use that metal one but to me if you don't use that sometimes then you don't get everything off so I don't know maybe I need to change up what I use let me show you guys and this is a new one I just got a clean one today but I use this to clean only my pots so that's probably why they are looking like this and I will show you guys actually because I'm going to be getting rid of these and I'm not going to give them to Goodwill or anything because who wants these okay perfect example don't judge me so not all of my pots but some of my pots are looking like this and it's warped so it's time and see it's green when I used to really like green so this was a Paula Deen pot so yeah you guys I'm throwing these away just wanted to show you guys the bottom of the pot see how worn and old it is and I don't even like this green anymore I actually think this is so ugly now 
and the pots that I'm getting, and you guys are probably like, will she be quiet about them pots, them pots, them pots? But I'm excited, you guys. It doesn't take much to make me happy and excited, and little things like that make me excited. But anyway, the pots that I'm getting today, um, they're actually on the truck out for delivery. I ordered them from Amazon, and they are the Rachel Ray pots, and it's gray with the red handle to match my cabinets here in the kitchen so yeah hopefully they are of a better quality and then I just need to focus on not using that Brillo pad or whatever that thing is called that metal scrubber on scraping the bottom of it I will show you guys the pots when I get them and that's the reason why I'm washing the dishes because they didn't have very much in the sink, but I want the dishwasher to be clear so that way when I get the new pots, I can run them through a cycle in the dishwasher before we use them. Okay, so I know it doesn't look like much right now, but this is only the first coat and I'm going for the ombre look. So um, three different colors and I'm using Waverly chalk paint that I got at Walmart, not sponsored. But anyway, the bottom color is called Ocean. It's really dark and then this middle color is agave I think yes it's agave and then the top color here is called pool p-o-o-l <laughs> so yeah i just put those three coats on there and then once it dries i will give it another coat and i'm trying not to make it even that's why it looks like this it'll all come together and then when i'm done i will go through with Oh, I thought I brought my white paint. I would go through with white paint just to give it like that, I don't know, that weathered look. So yeah, this is something that I'm doing for my mom. Oh, and my mom is here, you guys. Um, she's asleep right now, but yeah, she's here. So yeah, I will show you guys this after I've done the second coat. So my pots are here. I'm so excited. They are super cute. It's a 13 piece set and over here right there and then it also came with one baking pan which I'm gonna get more separate baking pans but yeah these are the Rachel Ray I don't know if you guys can see the yeah Rachel Ray um, brand and her little line whatever you want to call it right there but I'm super excited so I'm gonna throw this in the dishwasher and next time I cook I will be using Rachel Ray pans so all of the pots are in here are ready to be washed I'm so excited. And in case you were wondering, yes, it's still looking good after I spray painted it. Here are all my old pots. And as you can see, all of them are scratched up on the inside. Not very good for anyone to be eating out of. So I'm not even giving this to Goodwill because no one should be eating out of pots like this. I'm going to actually throw them away. Look at these skillets, you guys. Yeah, pretty bad. So all this is going to the dump. So here is the vase that I finished. I am not liking the jute cord around the top. So I actually think I'm gonna take that off. I don't like that at all. The actual vase turned out pretty good. So yeah, I think it's cute, but that has to go because that's not cute at all. So it is much, much later. I'm tired you guys. It is almost 7 o'clock and I am exhausted. Probably because I was up early this morning doing whatever so I'm probably gonna lay here till I fall asleep which will be pretty soon because I'm just tired but um didn't do much um straight up the house. I showed you guys what I made earlier and I did take off that rope around the base because that was horrible that it just looked tacky. It looked thrown together the rope at least so yeah i did that and then just watched a few things on youtube not the final thing but one of the last things before i get my chair i got today also for my corner over there and it looks so good i haven't completely decorated everything because i don't know i want to wait till the chair gets here so i did order the chair you guys and I pretty much knew when I first seen this chair that I was actually going to get it. Let me mute this. I'm actually watching, um, let me just pause it actually. I'm watching something on Hulu that talks about the dating game killer. I don't know if you guys ever heard about that, but years ago when that show, The Dating Game was on TV, um, a guy that was on there, he was a killer, one of the bachelors. Yeah. Anyway, that's what I'm watching. But, um, what am I saying? 
So I don't wanna decorate my corner yet, even though I have everything in there that I'm going to decorate with because I wanna wait till I get my chair. Oh, that's what I was telling you guys about my chair. So when I first seen this chair, I was searching on Amazon, I was searching on Overstock and whatever, but I seen this chair on Amazon, and when I seen it, it's kinda expensive, but when I seen it, I, I kinda knew in my heart I was going to get it, even though I was trying to search for, see if I could find it somewhere for cheaper. I even looked on Facebook Marketplace, but I don't know, something like a, a chair that people sit in, that's kinda like, it's like buying a mattress from someone that you don't know, or I don't know, it's, I just felt kinda weird about that. I didn't find it on Facebook Market, I was just looking to see what other chairs I can find, and I did find some really nice looking chairs, that would have looked great in this corner, but it's not going with the theme that I have. So this chair that I see, even though it was expensive, I'm like, you know what, let me get it because it looks the best. It looks the best. It's going to look the best when I get it. So I ordered it. It's not going to be here until February 2nd. So hopefully it'll get here sooner because a few of the things that I got said that it was going to take a long time for me to get and it ended up coming sooner so hopefully that will be the case with that but I'm just looking at everything I cannot wait to reveal this to you guys it's so nice I can't wait to do sit down videos in this corner for you guys so yeah I just think it's cute I like it I'm loving it so yeah anyway um I'm actually probably going to jump in the shower and then just relax the rest of the night haven't did anything but if I think of anything else I'll come back so it's like days later since I last filmed but I wanted to show you guys I'm using one of my pots for the first time and I know this looks really weird but I just cut up my bacon because I'm putting it in salad for me and Cheyenne but you know Savannah doesn't eat meat so anyway <laughs> I'm frying this up I'm using my new um, Rachel Ray spatula as well so yeah, I'm excited to use this, you guys. It doesn't take much to excite me at all. And I'm so excited my chair came today, but I'm not going to show you yet until I put it together. And then I can finally film the video of my little reading corner. So, yay, you guys, I am done. Well, almost. Just got to put the chair together. So I absolutely loved the pot. Love, love, loved it. And aren't all new pots good but anyway the bacon was just sliding around all easily and everything my old pot bacon was thick so I don't know anyway I'm loving it and yes I look like this y'all know work from home <laughs> so um anyway I'm gonna relax a little bit it's still quite early it is 5 36 and I'm gonna relax a little bit and then I'm gonna put the chair together and then I may film the full reveal video which you guys will get this video before the reveal, but yeah, I'm excited, you guys. I can finally stop talking about this stinking reading corner, and so you guys can see all the work I've done. I'm actually pretty proud, quite proud of this little area. It's so cute. Can't wait to show you guys.